In the past few years, colon cancer has started appearing in younger people more and more. Caroline Carruthers' sister, Emily King, who lives here along the Gulf Coast, has been battling colon cancer for the last year and a half. Caroline is here with her story in hopes of raising awareness about this type of cancer. My sister Emily is 28 years old. In April of 2019, she found blood in her stool. 24 hours later, she was diagnosed with stage 3 colon cancer. I had surgery to remove my colon cancer and that caused um, a bowel obstruction. Because of the obstruction, Emily had to have an ileostomy bag for eight months while she did 12 rounds of chemotherapy to let her colon heal. After 12 rounds of chemo, Emily was in the clear. So I did a routine PET scan. I was three months with no evidence of disease and uh, my PET scan came back with a little bit of cancer still inside my body. So Emily had surgery again to remove more cancer. She then had another PET scan before starting another cycle of chemo. The scan showed the cancer had spread to her lungs. So I got transferred to being a stage 3 colon cancer patient to a stage 4 colon cancer patient. I'm doing a new type of chemotherapy and um, we're hoping this one works this time. Unfortunately, doctors have seen more and more young people get diagnosed with colon cancer, and they're not sure why. It's almost an epidemic of young people. It's uh, been quite frightening, and in fact, it's been such a problem that they set up a young person's colon cancer clinic at the Dana-Farber in Boston, which is where we sent Emily. Emily has chosen to live her colon cancer journey publicly through blog posts that her husband writes and shares on social media. Her motto through this hard time is fighting to win. We literally have thousands of people that write us, pray for us, send us things. It is absolutely amazing. Emily actually just got some great news. She had another PET scan halfway through her second chemo regimen and they found no evidence of cancer, which means her new type of chemo is working. In the studio, Caroline Carruthers, WKRG News 5. That is some great news. Dr. Mishad says some of the warning signs for colon cancer include blood in your stool, change in bowel habits, and abdominal pain. Make sure you listen to your body and get checked regularly.